Okay, let's talk about how to get out of a bunker. I'm Adam Bazaljad here in Naples, Florida, founder of Scratch Golf Academy. And the people we're really speaking to today are the ones that leave the ball in the bunker a lot, and also at times shoot the ball out of the bunker or thin the ball out of the bunker. That's the ones we want to speak to. Now, something you'll have probably read a lot or heard a lot, and it is true, but we're going to modify it, is use a lot of the bounce of the club, open the face, and really splash the club off the sand. Hey, there's an element of truth to that, and the best players do, uh, do that. But the problem with most people is they actually scoop the ball too much. And the bottom of the swing is too far back, so they hit the sand either too early, or they're coming out of the sand and they thin the ball. For them, they've really got to start to understand you have to be descending when you hit the sand shot. Let me show you a close-up of how to do that. So there's a greenside bunker shot. You can probably see there that I hit maybe three, four inches behind the ball. And there's the divot. Now what you'll notice is the middle of the divot is in front of the golf ball. And the middle of the divot, round numbers, designates the lowest point of the golf swing. So remember, even though we hit the sand before the ball to make sure the club face gets down there and gets in reasonable contact with the ball, the club is still descending and must reach the bottom of the swing beyond the ball. If you start bottoming out here and starting your upswing at the ball, you're gonna really struggle. Okay, I hope that helps you get a little clearer understanding of, uh, of what we're really trying to do here. Now, how, what's a drill you could use? I would recommend a couple of the following. Draw a line in the practice bunker, of course, opposite a golf ball, and just practice setting a little bit more of your weight to your left, and practice feeling like you unhinge the club down to a low point over here. Just little swings like that until you can feel like the club's lower on this side of that line than it is on that side of the line. Then actually hit a couple of little shots, same thing. Now you can open the club a little bit, it doesn't have to be closed. And just finish really low. The ball may only go 10 or 15 feet, like that, and practice finishing low. Get the bottom of the swing in front of the ball. That is the first start before you start doing all the tricky things with the club face and that'll get you on the path to better bunker play. If you like this, tap the thumbs up button. We'll get you some more free content, get you subscribed to the channel. Founder of Scratch Golf Academy, I hope that helps you, and uh, best of luck getting out of the bunker.